President Donald Trump told Americans on Wednesday that the risk from coronavirus remained very low and placed Vice President Mike Pence in charge of the U.S. response to the looming global health crisis. But we're very, very ready for this, for anything, whether it's going to be a uh, breakout of larger proportions or whether or not we're, uh, you know, we're at that very low level. And uh, we want to keep it that way. So we're at the low level. As they get better, we take them off the list. Health officials on Wednesday warned Americans to prepare for more coronavirus cases, and New York City announced plans to provide up to 1,200 hospital beds if needed as U.S. stock markets fell for the fifth consecutive day. Uh, but uh, from a public point of view, Trump said he would accept whatever emergency spending Congress decided was appropriate for the crisis and that he was not ready to institute new travel restrictions for countries such as South Korea and Italy that are dealing with outbreaks although he could not rule it out. I not put confusion. For the time frame. Dr. Anthony Fauci, the head of the National Institute of Allergy and Infectious Diseases, said earlier in the day that while the virus was contained in the United States, Americans must prepare for a potential outbreak as transmission spread outside of China. Trump is seeking $2.5 billion from Congress to boost the government's virus response, an amount Democrats said falls far short of what is needed and have also urged the White House to appoint a czar to coordinate a national response.